Today's video from Sharpel, we're going to quickly demonstrate how you can log in and log out uh, a basic operation of the XEA203, 206, 20S and 506 registers. Obviously in this video I'm using the 203 but the process will be the same across the range. So on the machine as standard you have um, cashiers or clerks numbered 1 to 25 and all you do to log in um, is press the number unless you've set up a secret pin code and then the CLK hash button here. So currently on this machine I've got four dashes on the display. I'm in the reg mode but it won't let me put a sale through until I've logged in so I'll just get the error message not assigned. So I press CL to clear the error message and then I sign in as one of my operators so operator one and then CLK hash and that's logged me in. So that operator can now use the register, process sales, so you've got the receipt switched on, you'll get an auto receipt print out. We'll just quickly turn around to the XZ position and I'll turn the receipt off because we don't want one printing out of every test sale. Um, login as operator 2, 2 and then the button. She can start a sale. One thing you can't do on this machine is interrupt each other. So Kate, operator 2, has got the um, till open. But if Harry came along, for example, and tried to sign in, he couldn't sign in until Kate had finished her transaction. So you would simply press clear to get rid of that free, finalize the sale, and then operator free is free to log in. If you want to log out, so you've finished your transaction and you don't want to uh, remain in the till, then you simply double press the CLK hash button and then you get the four dashes back. So that means that you can't use the till again without signing in. So you try and process a transaction and again, you'll just get not assigned. Clear, operator number, and then CLK hash. There's up to 25 operators on the machine, so 25, Clark will sign you in, but if you try and sign in as operator 26, you'll get the no record error message. Okay, I hope that video has been helpful. We've got plenty more videos showing you how to get the best out of the XEA203 and other sharp cash registers. Some of those videos appearing on screen now, so you're welcome to check those out. You can also subscribe to this YouTube channel or visit sharphelp.co.uk for more. Thanks for watching.